I've told you this before, but I want to reinforce it that all year long, you are going to be saving out your work for your journal. And we're going to use the file, export, save for web. And I know it says legacy. And, and oh, I, I can just do it here and it's so, so much easier. I can just export and hit return. There's a reason for this. If you want me to go through all the details and rationale, I will, but I ask you just to trust me and maybe even to learn that shortcut. But this is what we're using and the shortcut is Shift Option Command S. And Shift Option Command S or File Export Save for Web Legacy will bring you to this dialog box. And here, I want this to say JPEG high. Now I collected those fall concert posters and there were pings in there, there were GIFs in there, there were misnamed JPEGs which tell me you're using a different export uh, function of Illustrator. And yes, they may seem easier to use, but there are reasons for you to use this. Most importantly, as we can see, the width and height and change things here if we need to. This width, 2900, is bigger than I want you to be working. We'll cover the maximum size in another video, but for now, please, please. I'm going to hit escape to get out of there. Shift, Option, Command, S is the shortcut. I mean, you might as well learn it. You're going to use it hundreds of times this year. JPEG high. Got it? JPEG high. Hi, right here, up at the name. You can do this.